68 year old Terry Ray Kriegler, who has been in police custody since the 10th of November, arrived at the Mavoko Law Courts under heavy security. He is accused of defiling a three year old girl in Athi River earlier this month, one of three defilement charges he is facing. Krigler remained calm as the charges were read out before Mavoko Senior Principal Magistrate Barbara Ojo. It would not be proper. Uh, for administration of justice if I were to ignore the state council's contention on the accused, accused person's past antecedents. Given the foregoing, I decline to grant bond to the accused person for now. I direct that the state council uh, verify and ascertain from the relevant authorities the status of the accused person in relation to the crimes allegedly committed in the United States of America and report back to the court with due expedition. Uh, but not later than 30 days from uh, the date here of... A repeat offender, Krigler first hit the headlines in 2013 when he was arrested by Kenyan authorities for his involvement in a child sex ring. In 2014, he was sentenced to 50 years in prison after pleading guilty to a charge of child pornography. Through an appeal, Krigler challenged the sentence for being too harsh and appealed to the then DPP, Nurdin Haji, asked the High Court to dismiss. He was, however, released from prison under unclear circumstances in 2022 after serving only eight years. Now, back in court, Magistrate Barbara Ojo denied him bail, describing him as a flight risk and a fugitive. You're charged with the offense of promoting a sexual offense with a child contrary to the law, the particulars being that Terry Ray, alias Buka Terry, on diverse dates between 1st of October and 8th of November 2023 at Great Wall Gardens mm. Estate Phase 3, which is in the River, Machakos County, you displayed to ABN a child aged three years with sex toys, which was intended to be used with the intention of encouraging ABM to perform sexual acts. Is it true or not true? No. The case will be mentioned on the 27th of November in preparation for a hearing. Michelle Ngele Odiambo, K24.